Hey guys, we already pre-planned a metro depot some while ago and now it's time to build the metro system for the region to better connect the two main cities on the map. The idea was to have two lines that meet each other at the same spot in both downtowns respectively to have easy transfers between the lines. But they will of course take two separate routes to cover the most important areas and the most amount of people. Line 2 will also connect to the city's suburban rail network twice. So let's see what are the two routes that I had in mind. Line 1 starts at the waste to energy plant east of downtown 1. Guys, please give me name suggestions for both cities and some neighborhoods. I'm so uncreative in that regard. Then it stops one more time until it crosses the river and reaches the central business district. Here I will place two metro stations directly next to each other so people can easily switch lines here. The next stop will be near the Notre Dame church until the tunnel makes its way to the industrial area. Now comes a challenging part because we have to somehow cross the river and pay attention to somewhat realistic slopes because the terrain is quite hilly here. After we cross the river it goes uphill into the second big city on the map. Here there will be another stop located near the tram network to make transfers between the different modes more convenient. Now we reach the second downtown with another transfer point to line 2. Afterward, there will be a huge right turn to cover the area of the very first episodes around the fort and the line will end at the industrial area next to the container port. Line 2 starts for now at the transfer station to Line 1 at the CBD station. Then it stops at the built-in subway stop of Central Station to allow for easy transfers to intercity and commuter trains. From here it goes to the university and climbs up the hill to the co-op low-rent housing district. Now comes the most challenging part of the whole system. We have to go down to below sea level to tunnel the waterway until we reach the second downtown again. Here the tunnels have some serious elevation. From the downtown transfer hub, it follows a straight line to the train station again. Then the line will make a right bend to have two more stops at the industrial area here. Okay, let's go! So let's fly in and see where we start. I'll be back at the end to draw a conclusion how it all went.
Awesome! I hope you liked that little speed build and got some inspiration on how to design metro stops. I tried to decorate them a little bit with paths and trees to make them look more important. Of course I wished we would have more possibilities, especially overground or cross and multi-platform stations, but that's unfortunately all we have for now but I'm sure we will get a lot more content in the future. I let the simulation run for a while and surprisingly the Metro was very well received by the Sims real quick. It is now the most used mode of transportation in the city, which makes me very happy. So that was a little video on how to design a Metro system for a city. I hope you enjoyed it and if you would like to have access to the save game, consider supporting me on Patreon for that. Anyway, I hope you have a nice rest of your day. Thanks for watching and bye bye.